lights in the station. I think if you pick Hephaestus uh, without Grumpus in your party, it tells you that you have to go back to pick up Grumpus. Because he's the one who wants to go there. Oh yeah, we've got a note from Wanda. We're not too late yet. I don't know. No, I didn't. Another 500 loonies. Good luck. And thank you for the money. We'll have to come back with Grumpos to this dude uh, to convince him to sell, him, to sell us his mistake. But we'll have to come back with Grumpos anyway when we go to Hephaestus. We have to come pick up a spaceship. So in that case we will uh, pass there anyway. <laughs> you may have. Right. Um, I doubt they'd be willing to give us that thing willingly. Oh, Pax God. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yes, yes, it is. Uh, what was it that we needed? This one. This is the thing. Oh, yeah. I remember that. That's what we need. Man, if that pack scout wasn't trolling around here, I'd just grab the TDD and be off. We should come back when there's less heat. Indeed, we should. So, we can't pick up now. We'll have to wait until. Pax God will be gone. Basically, at some event, uh, it will go dark, like night time. And we can go back. Let's check if there's anyone new in the Royal Penthouse Suite. And maybe spend the night in the... in the dorms. Where people have been having nightmares, just to see what, what's there. Not only was the disaster on Sunday the most devastating blow to science the universe has ever known, it was also the most catastrophic loss of life. Yes, yes it was. Oh hey, um, I must be dreaming. <laughs> but the planet is only four feet tall. Oh dear, you didn't activate the secret compression device, did you? However, did you all agree on it? <laughs> Alright. He's an engineer. Uh, we'll need him to unlock our special battle skills. Uh, as far as I know, they come in the form of um, plans, schematics, and he can actually read them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, we're not going to Cordica, but I will. There wasn't really anything new there. Um, there was that kid with the tree thing. Let's see if there's... Now there's a spaceship. Awesome. So, leaving must have spawned it. I'm going to grab it for him. Oh, where am I going? I can't really see what's happening, but I got it. Oh, hey, kids. Uh, <laughs> yeah, do you have something to trade? <laughs> it's okay if you're into historic gaming, I guess. Sucker. I totally am in historic gaming. Yeah. 
That's cool. Uh, so we have a game now. Uh, cartridge, game cartridge. Um, as you may remember, Boots in his office has a TV in the back with his old arcade uh, gaming system. So you can actually play these games on Boots' television. This way to go to the things. There's also a bag of glodents we can pick up from one of the rooms here. But I'm gonna see if we can just. Should I shave between my eyebrows? <laughs> uh, pillow, please. a refreshing nap and I think everyone should now be uh, maximum health and energy yeah actually I don't know if it ups your energy but your health whatever <laughs> you may have been rowed about mistake but that's no excuse for sloppy science why with your shortage of scientific savvy I doubt you could even figure out how to activate this cubic impactor without an instruction manual awesome so row got I assume yeah, a new weapon. There we go, we need that. admit I don't think I ever got that weapon for um, Dr. Bowman. As I said I've played this game a couple of times before but I've never managed to get all of the upgrades for everyone or all of the collections. Um, I guess I could use a, uh, a guide. But I think even guides are not complete because this game is, is not very um, popular. Still watching that clown, eh? Alrighty. We actually need to go to the... Uh, what's it called? Um... The red light district and I think I'm going to bring pal for that just for the sake of good old times you know boots and pal uh, 
solo so reminds me that we can now actually we can actually go back to an Acronox with Pal and uh, get an upgrade for him but I won't do that just yet because we've just been to an Acronox and I don't want to keep back and forthing all the time This was the entrance to the red light district. Last time we were here at Cinder Station, we couldn't actually go in there um, because the control panel was shot. But that should be fixed now. We'll have to fight all the same enemies again first. a good start of a new gun but We'll need to find an upgrade for little pal. Because he's, he's a bit under leveled at the moment, he's not doing a ton of damage. Alrighty.
Righty. Still broken. Pretty sure I could repair this panel if I had some more context. Like this. It's a detailed schematic of the panel's interior. Something, someone must be repairing it. So, let's analyze this. Okay, I c believe I can fix and operate the panel now. There we go. All fixed. Oh. can be poisoned. Pretty sure he does. Oh. Awesome. These are annoying. They do a ton of damage. Uh, I don't need to heal anyone. Not she might be What's she wearing? worth it though, the red, uh, red light district is kind of also. <laughs>
he'll fell off a bit. Uh, he really isn't equipped for this area. And you can also see why I love uh, Rose special plasma wall so much. It is kind of overpowered to be honest. It's ridiculously handy when you're fighting multiple enemies. Uh, so that goes to the pumping station, to the red light district, that goes somewhere else. Uh, drunk babies. <laughs> chug, chug, chug. You there with your bag. I'm out of here. I don't care what you're offering or selling. I've had enough of the red light district. I heard the red light district was a hot scene, man. I came out with some friends of mine for a night of fun. 32 hours later, I've gotten falling down drunk, been slipped the tab of blue cloven, groped the hook hooker in the dark, been shot at by the Brebulon Mafia, woken up in these clothes, danced for money, and escaped with this big bag of stolen money, uh, dung. This is a bag of dung, not money. You can only mean trouble, excuse me, but get away. <laughs> Sounds like you had an interesting night. I mean, why do you hate it? Got a big bag of money. <laughs> yeah, so this is the red light district. Something for everyone. Slotopia. Look, bippies. Even they can get what they want here. this mini cash it's mine now looks like someone's been murdered here oh is that a church it's got a phone number is that a nun like one of those monks we saw earlier saint annie <laughs> right. <laughs> Say club foot. <laughs> Ugh, no thanks. Hi. <laughs> no thanks. Yeah. All this time I thought I was smooth down there. Hey, yes, I am looking for Kvester. 
It's funny you should ask. My buddy pal Sam Schlong's involved in some offshore drilling with Kvestas very young and quite frankly drop dead wife. He tends to know where and what Kvestas is doing. You might want to ask him. I think he was heading to Mistress Movinas to have his fortune told. You dig the outfit? The sailor thing seems to be such the rave these days. And I'm always scur a scurrying bitch for trends. You know what I mean? <laughs> yep. Garbage. Okay. Garbage. Garbage. Is there any point in being able to select the garbage? I don't know. Oh, look at this cute bot. actually do that at some point but it's very difficult because you have to obviously fight your way down here again. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> Not really. Mm-hmm. The pipes. Blame it on the other guy. Are they making out? Right, booze and condoms. That's uh, this is where uh, we'll find the the guy who might know where Kvester is. Alright, let's uh, check out the shop, see what they've got. Is that the lady who said hi, boobs? Uh, no thanks. Brain piercing, eh? Mm-hmm, I'm sure it does. Tiny float there. Hey there. Stop. Lost my shopping list. Mm -hmm. You just got a carton of lap ladder and some grease crayons in the back if you're interested. Uh, no. I told you once. <laughs> He really likes meat. Another one of the sailor dudes. Okay, so we can buy heel grease here. Is that the floater? Yeah. Lord Hulaha. Okay. really need anything at the moment, we don't need heal this. Um, various pink bits. Cool. Let's go check out the uh, 